<sighs> well, guys, we're gonna try it again. But this time, I'm gonna try to remain calm during this matchup. And I've gotten some help from my good old friend, Bill. So, let's get this going here. So, Bill has showed me some nice calming techniques so I don't flip out at the game. So, here we go. Bill will be in my lower right hand corner so I do not lose my head during this freaking matchup. I will not lose my mind in this god dang matchup. So, here we go. Let's freaking do this. Alright, so Bill's just going to hang out here in the lower right hand corner, and here we go. I believe uh, someone told me I should use the meter pitching, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. Oh, I can't. I'm gonna go ahead and use the meter again. The old times. Th didn't I use the meter in MLB 11? Might have. Hmm. Tim Lincecum really went down, hasn't he? Johnny Venner will step to the plate. All right, let's try the meter pitching. PS4 is going nuts right now. I hope that's hopefully that's not a bad sign, man. Fans going off like crazy right now. All right, pitching. So we're going to use meter. Underway at the ballpark nice. this afternoon as the first pitch is in there for strike one. You know, this Yankee ball club entering play this afternoon here, EK. They come in in a real funk to start Gosh, the year. Darn it. Still searching for what's been an elusive first win. When you're looking at trying to get out of a funk like this, it always helps when you can hand the ball over to a veteran starter that's been through this before. And luckily for them, they're going to be able to do that here. And he lays off a pitch outside as they draw even at 2-2. Two 2-2 and two. Two, two pitch on the way. Now a swing and a sharp ground ball to third. And All right. First step. There we go. Hopefully this is good things to come. So the base is empty here with one away. And standing in now, the power-hitting second baseman, Jason Kipnis. And they start him with one high and away for ball one. The left-handed hitting Kipnis awaits the 1-0. Lays off a fastball that doesn't Gosh, miss it. by much, and it's 2-0. and Well, one of the real strengths of his game is that he's not going to go after a whole lot of bad pitches. Ooh, that was right, right down the middle. So he's a guy that's going to make you earn it Ooh. by only swinging Could have blasted right. that. Right on the corner, 2-2. Two and two. Yeah, and it's hard to look for a change up there, especially when a guy's got a good live fastball. Swing and a yes. fastball that time, out number two. Mike Trout will stand in, and that average has to be a source of pride for him early on. He's got it up over 350 to start. Oh, that's close. Now a fastball, a bit too low here. It's ball one, and the pitch. Two oh low. man! You still come after him now. Darn it! I think you have to be a little careful, but yeah, I don't think you can just give up on him. And this nice. is fouled back and out of play. Here's Lincecum now on two and one. Just oh, the inside part of the up and everything. And 
they know full well the threat that this guy poses. So even down three and one, I can't imagine he's gonna get anything that he can drive right here. Three and two, here it is. Late on the fastball yes. there. This one skied out toward Could have been a disaster. Mike Trout at the plate. Springer Good. Is there, makes the catch in the side oh my God! I got it through a first inning without letting a run in. Oh my God! Bill has really helped out. Big tag. He's coming to bat. You're watching Major League Baseball on the show. D. Gordon will step in for the first time, and as you can see, not the fastest of starts for him this first week of the season. And a ball one and zero. Oh. Now the pitch. First two pitches off the mark here. It's 2-0. Oh. Yeah, a little unlucky here to be behind 2-0. Oh. Those first couple of pitches haven't missed by a whole lot. Oh, that one's more likely can't believe I let that one go. 2-1 and one now. And that's about where he'll sit with that fastball. 93-94. That's plenty of yes! hard. Yes! Yes! Go D. Gordon, you're fast enough. Field. My guy, he's almost around second base already. Jeez. Their first hit of the ball game, a leadoff double. Ruzne Castillo digs in at the plate. First pitch coming. Oh, right freaking down the middle. Screw you. This is the kind of situation where they came up short last night. They had opportunities, but they could never really cash them in, so... Oh, yes, I got him to third base. Yes. Yes. Matt Adams will stand in. He's got that average pushing up near 300 to start the new season. Here's the first offering. And here's a oh, well, that was a nice spot, man. That one too much, but it's 0-1. One thing to keep an eye on as this game goes along First pitch strike. Yes! The more this guy can... And a base hit as the run will score from third, and the Yankees score first. Woo! It's one to nothing. Yes! Evan Gaddis will stand in. He comes off an 0 for 4 in last night's ball game. Now here's the first pitch. Now here's a fast that ball up. That sucks. That sends in the air out to fairly deep that center field. Freaking blow. You drop it, sir. There are two gone I hate you. Why didn't you let that slip through your freaking mitt? Like a butter mitt. Manny Machado will get his first shot here. Two hits in five trips a night ago. First pitch on the way. Fastball in there for a called strike. It's so important with guys like this to get ahead with strike one. Put them behind in the count and on their back foot right away. Now a fastball here, not close, and it's one and one now. Here's the one one. Just does manage Ooh. to get a piece there as this is bounced foul. Darn it. it late. Here comes the one two. It's a two balls and two strikes now. Will not go down without a fight, sir. Comes on two and two. And a oh! All he could do was reach out in vain for I that freaking one. sucked on that tired. one. Oh my goodness. Let's Jose get Jose Batista. Batista. Out. In now. Two hits for him, including a home run in last night's contest. Come on, come on, come on! Yes! But did he hold up in time? No, swung the bat, says Clyde Washington at strike one. Lincecum ready, the 0 1. That was horrible. Shave the corner with that pitch, but it's one and one. The one one from Lincecum. No offer on that one. Two Darn balls it. and a strike. But when you start that pitch off the edge, you know, most guys know well enough to lay off. Yes. You gotta start it on the edge if you want him to chase. The two two from Lincecum. Swing and yes. Right Got you, Jose. I got you. Victor Martinez will get his first opportunity here. Took an 0 for 4 in the victory last night. Now oh, so close. Here. It's ball one. Yankees lead this one to nothing here in inning number two. Here comes the 1 0. Over towards the dugout, but this one will get into the stands. 
one one on the way inside and low two and one and now pitch on the way inside oh. for a ball as he falls behind to him here three and one not only do you not want to lose this guy you got more trouble right there in the on deck circle and a Ooh, that was a wild one. Ball four. We'll get on that, Victor. Oh, great. Matt, Matt Holliday. We'll get his first shot here. A couple of hits in four trips last night. Ah. Tyson with a high fastball, but he wouldn't commit. It's ball one. He's set. Now the pitch. Yes. Gotcha. That time as it's a ball and a strike. Now he's probably lucky he didn't make contact on that one. Ah. He lays off for a ball, two and one. Yeah, it, it's so easy to get caught reaching on that pitch. Darn I've seen a few of his teammates do it already. That's a great job to recognize slider and play off. Swing and a ball hit well to the right side, but this will get into the crowd. Full count pitch on its way. Now here's a ball. Oh, you jerk off. Field, and that's going to get down for him, a base hit. David Wright will stand in, and he is off to a dreadful start at the plate as he has not hit the ball well in April. And a high strike to begin the at-bat. It's 0-1. And, you know, if you're going to challenge a guy up in the zone with a fastball, why not do it on the first uh. pitch? A lot of times he's going to be taken anyway, and you just bought yourself a strike that you can now throw anything off of. And a bouncing ball, foul. Now Lincecum's 1-2 outside and low that time. Now it's two balls and two strikes. He's ready. Now the pitch. And now this oh. ball's lifted in the air down the right field line, but this will get back into the seats, so the count holds at 2-2. Two and two. In the air. No! Oh, man, that sucks. This will get one home and maybe two. And the run will score from second to tie the ball game at one and one. Oswaldo Arcia will dig in with a couple of guys in scoring position and a chance to take the lead here in the early going. First pitch fastball off the plate there, and it's ball one. Well, that one definitely took off on him right there. He's lucky that thing didn't go all the way to the backstop. Meanwhile, oh. this ball's trouble as it looks like it'll be good for extra bases. And he is in to score as well. And they've taken the lead now. It's 3-1. to one. Tyler Flowers will stand in. And you can see that early season average up into the high 300s now. And he'll take strike one on the fastball, registering at 93 that time. Well, we'll give you a look there at the graphic. He picks up his first two-base hit of the new season. The 0-2 coming now from Lincecum. And the slider gets him swinging, two gone. Johnny Venner will get a second shot now. He grounded out to start the ball game. Good fastball there from Lincecum as he's really popping the glove now. It's strike one. Fox, now the pitch. And now a pitch hit sharply on the ground. Stabs for it. He's got it. And the throw yes. does beat him at Whoa. the bag. So that was close. Retired. All right, I just need to catch up. A lot of time to catch up. We'll start things off in the bottom of the second. Now here's the first pitch. A ball hit hard to the left yes. side. Yes. And that's a base hit, so the pressure's on to open up the inning. George Springer will get his first shot at it here. And here's the first pitch. Oh, yikes. This is popped oh. high into the air on the left side. It's horrible. Benner battles the sun a bit, but has it for round number one. Starlin Castro will take his first cuts here with the runner still at first and one away now. First offering on the way. Swing and a ball. Oh, man. Wow, I lucked out there. And now it looks like we're going to get an argument here as here comes the skipper out of the first base dugout. And he looks to be trying to convince that second base umpire that the second baseman never had the ball. But you can see the umpire very clearly telling him that the drop was on the transfer. Jared Salto Lamar. Not even going to try hitting those curveballs anymore. Strike one. 
comes set. Now the pitch. And one and one as this one's in on the hands. And that's the right spot for that slider. Really try hard to tie him up inside. And that's a good job to lay off, too. Now a swing and a hard Oh, hit. you jerk off. Yeah, he made the same it. exact play. The first will get him easily, and the side is retired. So it's no runs on a hit, no errors, and a man left. Jason Kipnis is ready to go here as we begin the third. First pitch here is reached for and hit on the ground to third. Throw to first in All right. time, and the leadoff man is gone to start the third. Mike Trout will take his first cuts now, and obviously a dangerous hitter, the reigning American League MVP. Oh. And a slider tails outside for ball one. That's what you have to do against a big sweeping slider like that. It's oh, what the Ryan heck was that? Pitch got away and ended up hitting him, so he'll head down to first on the hit by pitch. Swing and a ball hit softly on the ground, but a foul ball here, 0 and 1. He set now the pitch, and boy, big oh, problems nice. here to start this at bat. It's 0 and 2 now, and that's not that is not good. Yeah, yeah. Swung on and missed four strikeouts already, and that's out number two. Victor Martinez will stand in, coming off a season in which he was named the American League's Silver Slugger at DH. Oh, and he misses it. Wow. Crowd around third. He can move. And tack on that was stupid. Make it I gotta admit, that was freaking stupid. <laughs> Matt Holliday. Will come forward now in an RBI opportunity he probably didn't think he'd have. Yeah, it certainly didn't look like he'd have one, but now is where you really have to make teams pay. Nothing will demoralize a team in the field quite like having two out airs that lead the run. Out of play off to the right. It's one and one. Ready now on one and one. Up high. Two and one now. Both clubs with three hits in the ballgame. Here's the two one now to Holiday. And this is going to be a foul ball. 2-2. Two, two. And Lincecum can't find the target on that one as he runs the count full now at 3-2. and two. A lot of deep counts. And we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three. And that will retire the side. D. Gordon makes his way to the plate to get us started here in the bottom of inning number three. Here's a fastball called for strike one. Here it comes. Now this is popped oh. up behind the plate for Flowers. And he'll reach to his right to make the catch for out number one. Ruzne Castillo will stand in. He grounded out his first time. First pitch coming. Off the plate and away there. One ball, no strikes. Four to one's our score here in inning number three. On a great pitch there, caught him reaching. It's one and one. Yeah, just really jumping out at that last pitch. He had him thinking fastball, maybe even slider. And here's a pitch swung on and missed. One and two now. Well, if he's going to overcommit to pitches like that down in the zone, I keep throwing him until he proves he can lay off. And they'll try to get him fishing there, but he won't offer in the dirt, and it's back to even at two and two. And the slider misses here, so he runs the count full three and two. Now here it comes. Oh, this is hit hard towards second. Darn it. But right to the second baseman, and that's the second out. Matt Adams will stand in. An RBI single in his first appearance. First pitch to him. He goes the other way as this is hit well out toward deep left field. Ugh. Holiday will get there and he puts it away to retire the side. David Wright will stand in now to get us going here in the fourth. First pitch coming. And oh, looked inside, but that's ruled a strike. Nothing in one. And for that guy right there, this is going to be an important inning. He's already given up four runs through three. And you know, they need to get a minimum of five, hopefully six innings out of him. So he needs to show something right here. And a good 0 2 pitch there, but right able to lay off to make it a ball and two strikes. Could be that that high fastball there was just a setup pitch. Now you've kind of established that high sight level. Could be a good time to break off a nasty curveball. 
Oswaldo Arcia will try to pick up where he left off. He doubled home a couple his first time around. Hit well down the left field line, but back into the crowd foul. Lincecum ready, the 0-1. Off the Ooh, plate and in. It's a close. ball and a strike. Here's the pitch. And he'll come back with one in the dirt as the count moves to two and one now. And after that double in his first at bat, you can tell they're approaching him with a bit more caution here. Well, they should. Here comes a two two. And Lincecum can't find the target on that one as he runs the count full now at three and two. That's a pitch you have to lay off right there. Yes. That tight slider busting down and out of the zone. All that can do is tie you up. Tyler Flowers will stand in here hoping to at least put a ball in play here this inning. In tight here with the well, first darn fastball that's 1-0. Oh. The next pitch. Fastball in there for a strike. 92 on the radar gun that time. The pitch. And he lays Darn. off this one down and in for ball two. Well, this is a spot where it helps to have a two-seam fastball like that so you can work in on the right-handed hitters. To two and two now. And the pitch. Full count. Three and two. Boy, you have got to make this guy swing the bat here on this next pitch. This is not the guy you want to lose. Lincecum's next pitch will be number 75 for the afternoon. Now a ball wow. hit is straight away left. This is carrying well out of here. A solo shot here to left as they stretch the lead to 5-1. Johnny Benner is in for the third time now as he takes a called strike. It's 0-1. Seems like they're showing a lot of faith in this guy, leaving him out there. And I think you appreciate that as a pitcher, but sometimes when you don't have it, you don't have it. it looks like this is going to be one of those times. Five runs on only four hits and no errors for the Red Sox to this point. And he struck him out, his eighth punch out of the ball game, and that one ends the inning. Evan Gaddis will lead things off here in the home half of the fourth. And now a check swing oh, and he hold up in time. No, swung the bat, says Clyde Washington at strike one. Now here's the pitch. This is foul right side. And now a pitch on the way. A little bit off the outside, it's one and two. He showed him that slider running away two times in a row. Now might be a good time three. to call him that two-seamer running in. And he takes strike three called on the fastball, one gone. So with one gone in the inning now, that brings in Manny Machado. And he gets ahead here with the fastball, <coughs> strike one. Well, that pitch isn't gonna light up the radar gun, but it's been effective. Well, it doesn't have to. If you get that good movement and put it in the right spot, it's plenty good enough to do the job. And that is going to be a base hit. So one gone in the inning here with the runner at first. And striding in is the first baseman, James Loney. Here's the first offering. First pitch fastball off the plate there, and it's ball one. The 1-0 pitch. Lined hard to center field. But ah. this will head straight to the center Eight. fielder as he puts it away without much trouble for the second out. George Springer will dig in. He popped out his first time. Now the first pitch. In there, no balls and a strike. Well, as we've seen so far, this isn't a team that's going to wait around too long to feel a pitcher out. They're an aggressive team all the way from top to bottom. And if that first pitch is anywhere close, most of these guys are going to take a hack at it. From the stretch. Swing and a miss. He struck him out with a two-seamer, and the inning is over. 
Jason Kipnis will dig in for the third time now. He struck out and bounced out in his first two trips. Here's Lincecum back to work now as he jumps ahead of the leadoff hitter, nothing in one. Well, this start's been a real bear for him so far. Uh, you see the pitch count here to start the fifth. That has to be a concern. The 1-1. Inside and low, two and one. Now here's the pitch. Started to go around, but he's able to check his swing for ball three. Well, I think he got the pitch he was looking for right there, but not in the right location. So that's a great job of just holding up the swing. Now the three one pitch. And a full count now, three and two. And it looks like the Yankees will have a left-hander up and throwing in the bullpen. And he punches out another one. Make it nine for the ball game. So one gone in the inning. And here's the always dangerous center fielder, Mike Trout. And Lincecum able to jump ahead with the fastball here. No balls and a strike. Now the pitch. And a pitch in the dirt as he lays off. It's one and one. Now the pitch. Down low again. It's two and one. Hits are now even at four apiece. And he fires a fastball now for a called strike two. That's one of those fastballs that just never feels like it's going to be a strike. It's up at the letters, and that's a tough one to do anything with. And the slider's in the dirt as he lays off it for a ball. And he takes ball four, so he's on. And as you know, that often means the steal could be in order here. Jose Bautista will step forward now following the walk as he'll hit with a definite speed threat at first and one away. You can bet he's going to see some fastballs in this out now. I'd be looking dead red. Runner goes for second. Pitches a cold strike. The throw. Not in time as he steals second. Two coming now from Lincecum. A ball and two strikes now to the 2014 All-Star. Well, you see there on the graphic, his first bag of the year here in the early going. And a change up here, but that's taken low in the dirt for a ball. And this is popped foul off to the right and back into the seats. Sets the 2-2 pitch. Donnie couldn't pull that one back as he clearly broke the plane of the plate, and that will be ruled a strike. Throw to first will take care of him. Score it two to three on the put out, and there are two gone now. Victor Martinez will stand in. He reached on an error last time through. Now he turns on a fastball here and sends it to deep right field. And Springer will tuck this one in to retire the side. Red Sox leave one. They're up five to one. Starlin Castro will stand in to start things out here in the home half of the fifth. And you get the sense, Steve, that this crowd's been pretty well taken out of the ballgame to this point. Yeah, they pretty much had to sit on their hands all afternoon. Not a lot to get excited about so far. And I think that's a credit to that man out there. Darn it, man. I can't hit anything. This lineup for the first four innings. Down and away, it's a ball and two strikes. A classic strikeout pitch there on 0-2. It's one he loves going to, but great recognition there at the plate to lay off. And here's a ball lifted back toward the stands in right, so we'll try it again at 1-2. and two. Now another 1-2. Grounded fouled off to the left, so they'll do it again. Here he comes again, 1-2. Struck him out, but he'll try for first on the drop third strike. Throw on to first is in time to get him, so that'll go down as a strikeout and a two to three put out for route number one. Jared Saltalamacchia will stand in. He grounded out his first time. And he'll try to crowd him there to start the at bat. It's one and oh. Pitch on the way. Now a swing and a hard hit ball to short. Oh, and it eats him up a bit. And they'll have no play as he reaches first base safely. D. Gordon will step in. One for two in the ballgame. Now the first pitch. Starts him out with a curveball for a strike. Pretty good speed here coming out of that left-handed batter's box. So it's no sure thing that a ground ball means a double play. 
in the dirt here. Watch out, watch your head. But fortunately here, no advance. 1-1 one, one pitch on the way. Now a big oh. swing as this is popped up. And I mean way up there uh. out of the infield. Martinez has to shade his eyes from the sun, but he stays with it for out number two. Darn it. Rusne Castillo will try things again. He's grounded out and lined out in two trips. First pitch coming. First pitch hacking here, and that's the first strike. You know, maybe the most impressive thing about his performance so far, he's doing it all in a hitter's ballpark. But it's hard to come in here and pitch like this, but he's done a heck of a job. And that'll get down for a base hit. See what he can do here with two on and two out here in inning number five. Here's the first offering. Swing and a ball hit hard on the ground at first. And the two out threat will not come to pass as the inning is over. Matt Holliday will get things started here in the top of inning number six. Charlie Furbush is out from the bullpen now as he'll be making his first appearance of this young season. Matt Holliday will stand in as he'll lead things off for the Red Sox in their half of the sixth. Now here's a ball hit hard on the ground to second, and that'll get on by into right field for a leadoff single. David Wright will dig in now. One for two to this point. Here's the first pitch to him. Running here is Holliday. This ball's hit in the air down the right side and out of play. 0-1. From the belt, the pitch. Now a change up in on the hands that evens it at one and one. He waits. Now the pitch. He'll try it again from first. Now a ball swung on and heading for the stands in right. And that'll move the count to one and two now. Here comes a one two. Lays off two and two now. He's set. Now the pitch. Hit on the ground to shortstop. To Gordon for one. On to first, and that'll take care of Wright, a double play. Oswaldo Arcia will get another shot. Struck out swinging his last time. First pitch on the way. And he starts the number eight hitter with a strike. Nothing in one. The pitch. Sticks with the fastball here as he forges ahead 0-2. And, and you kind of get the sense that he's not really messing around out there too much. There hasn't been a whole lot of setting guys up here in this inning. He's just trying to get himself back into that dugout as fast as he can. Fouled straight back. We're in the sixth inning now of a 5-1 to one ball game. Here's another 1-2. One, the 1-2 one, offering looked like a slider that time, but it's 2-2. Two and two. Yeah, that's a great pitch on 1-2. and two. Start it in the zone, and hopefully you'll get that guy thinking he needs to protect turned out to be a good take now a swing and a ground ball I pressed the wrong button now the relay oh, is still okay get him at first. okay <laughs> could have been thinking awesome around, but he's fortunate he got an out here. awesome no runs there we go hit no errors and no one left Evan Gaddis will stand in to lead off the inning middle third of the lineup four five and six as they try to get something going this whole lineup has been pretty quiet all game long just the one run. That's it. Here it comes. Swing. Hard hit ball to second. And the catch is made. One away. Manny Machado will stand in. A strikeout victim his first time and then a base hit last time around. The fastball here is he'll take a look at ball one. One and oh. Now here it comes. And that pitch misses in the dirt, and it's 2-0 and now. Yeah, and he didn't even have to think twice about that one. And now he's got a good hitter's count here, 2-0. and A curveball here, but he was waiting for it and sends it in the air to deep left. Uh. And he will run this one down. A good read off the bat for the second out. James Loney will stand in. He's one for two so far. Here's a swing and a wow. high pop-up. 
drifting toward the third base dugout. And Wright will make the catch to retire the side. Tyler Flowers will stride in again, and you can bet he'd love to do again what he did back in the fourth. A solo home run here that's been the only long ball of the game so far. And he's going to have room to put this one away, and that's the first out. Johnny Venner will stand in, and they've done a good job keeping him off base at the top of the lineup. He's 0 for 3 thus far. A fastball off the plate away. It's ball one. And the pitch. Pitch swung on and hit in the air toward the line in right. And he will run this one down, moving to his left, and that's the second out of the inning. Jason Kipnis will dig in. Strikeout victim his last time. And a high strike to begin the at-bat. It's 0-1. And you can see him trying to be a little bit more patient here. He's got two strikeouts already. But he's got to be careful not to fall too far behind. And now a pitch on the way. And he struck him out. There we go. And there's the hat trick as that's his third strikeout of the ball game. George Springer will step in now to lead off the home half of the seventh. Now here's the first pitch. Outside target here, and he hits it for strike one. And now Boston's bullpen springs into action. A left-hander and a right-hander begin to throw. Oh! And he didn't miss that by much. It's popped way up on the infield, and I mean way up there. And he'll stay with it here as he puts the squeeze on it for route number one. Starlin Castro will try again. Struck out swinging his last time through. Good breaking ball there. Had him frozen. Strike one. Yet again, another first pitch strike. And it's a big reason of why he's having the success he is. You establish the count in your favor right away, and it just opens up the door to so many more options going forward. Jared Saltalamacchia will dig in. One for two. He grounded out the first time and followed that with a base hit in his second plate appearance. Swing and a liner toward right center. Base hit. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. D. Gordon will stand in. He popped down in his last time. Now here's the first pitch. And this ball ah, is going to find the seats down the left field line. Foul strike one. Now some action out in the bullpen as a lefty and a right-hander begin throwing. He's ready. Now the pitch. Foul toward the third base dugout, but this will get back into the seats out of play. Come set, now the pitch. Oh, and a good curveball that time as it's taken for a called strike three, and there are two away. Rusne Castillo will get his shot now with two on and two out here in inning number seven. And now a ball lifted into the air out towards center field. <sighs> Trout is going to have room out there as he puts this away to retire the side. Mike Trout will stand in now to lead things off, and he'll do so with the same pitcher still out there. Seems he's earned himself another inning. I think that's a definite vote of confidence, but he's done a nice job since coming in, so you might as well ride that hot hand. Here's the pitch. That's in there as well. It's a quick 0-2 count. Now the pitch. Swing and a ball line hard nice. toward short. Well, this will be taken in out there at short, and that's the first out of the inning. Jose Bautista will stand in now, hoping to get on track as they've been able to neutralize his power out of the cleanup spot. 0 for 3 thus far. Lays off 1 and 0. The pitch. And this will be fouled away. Here's the 1 1. And here's Ooh. one that misses as the count moves to 2 and 1 on the Boston right field. Now here's the pitch. And this is fouled back and out of play. The 2 2 coming. A full count, three balls and two strikes. Victor Martinez waits on deck. Here's one that's ball four. Victor Martinez will stand in here. 0 for 2 with a run scored so far. Foul back. 
come set. Now the pitch. And that's swung on and fouled straight back. He's set. Now the pitch. There, did he go around? No, says the first base umpire. Ball one. Now the one two. And now a slider. There we go. There for a ball third strike. And there are two gone now. Matt Holliday will dig in. He singled his last time around. And a fastball's in there for strike one. Yeah, a little surprising he didn't offer it that one. That was a dangerous spot for a good fastball hitter. Ooh, that was close. Offer at that one. It's a ball and a strike. He's ready now. The pitch. Very high. Two and one. Ready with the 2 1. Fastball is looked at for strike two. And some action out in the Yankee bullpen now as a right hander starts to loosen up. And this will find the seats behind the first base dugout. Here's the 2 and 2 offering. And a liner foul into the seats down the right side. Now another 2 2. Fouled back. Ready with another 2-2. Swing and a hard hit grounder down the line. And he tries for the backhand reach at third, but it gets by the glove down the line. David Wright will stand in with a showdown looming. Two on, two out here in inning number eight. And he lays off a pitch in there for the first strike. A look here at the hits per side here in the late going. And that misses one and one. One one. And he finds a way to catch the zone here. It's one and two. From the belt. Kicks and deals. Now a fast. There we go. Another strikeout. Awesome. Fly and the inning is over. Boston strands a couple. They lead this one though. Five to one. Matt Adams. Will stand in to start out their half of the eighth with that starter still out there. And he's definitely been a tough nut to crack. No, he's been dominant all game long. And I think part of it is that he got himself a nice lead early on. And that's allowed him to not really worry about making a mistake. He's been free and easy the whole way through. Evan Gaddis comes on with one away as he looks at a ball. It's 1-0. Still won't get him to fish downstairs, and it's 2-0 now. And even though he's pitching well, this is a part of the order that he's really got to worry about. And they can turn a good outing into a bad one pretty darn quickly. Here it comes, 2-1. On the ground to third. There to get it is right. Throw in time at first for route number two. Manny Machado. Will stand in now with two away, needing to really get something started here. And their chances of getting back into this ball game are growing dimmer by the batter. And a first pitch slider is right there for strike one. Pitch on the way. And a fastball in the dirt that's taken for a ball. Here's the 1 1 pitch. And a slider misses here. Two balls and a strike. Well, one thing we've seen from this guy on the mound so far, when he makes bad pitches, they typically miss out of the strike zone. They don't miss in the and Sorry to interrupt, but the play has been made for the third out. Inning over. Oswaldo Arcia get us started as they look for a little insurance here in the top of the night. Here we go with inning number nine as the first pitch misses for ball one. Danny Farquhar will come on out of the bullpen as he'll be appearing in his third game this season. Oswaldo Arcia will get another crack, one for three thus far. Swing and he pops him up over toward foul territory. And the leadoff man retired here to kick off the ninth. Tyler Flowers will dig in. He homered back in the fourth. And here's the first pitch. Pretty well hit. Deep down the line in right, but that's back into the seats. Foul. 
Here it comes. And he powers the cut fastball by him that time, and he's in charge now, nothing and two. And the pitch. And he looks at a ball, one and two. That's a good location for that cut of two strikes. He's either got to take that, hope it's a ball, or he's got to foul that thing off. And a swing and a miss here, and the first two are dispatched to begin the ninth. Johnny Benner set the plate now as he looks at strike one. Now the pitch. And this is swung on and bounced out to the shortstop. Castro. Throw on Deloney will take care of him at first, and his side is retired. James Loney will go back now. He popped out in foul ground last time. And he gets ahead 0-1. Here's the pitch. Hit hard down the line toward the coaching box. It's a foul ball. The pitch. Now a ball hit pretty well to the left, but this is going to wind up in the seats foul. Another 0-2 coming. And he couldn't get him to chase the 0-2 fastball. It's 1-2. 1-2 pitch to Loney. Here's a swing and a ground ball. But this is a foul ball as the count holds steady at 1-2. and two. Again, a 1-2. Now a swing and a bouncing ball toward the hole. And he'll flip it to the pitcher covering for the out. George Springer will stand in, needing to do something here to get on base as they're down to their final two outs. And a good idea to hold off on that swing. It's ball one. Uh, he just about went around. He, he was lucky to put on the brakes when he did. Slider, but that's low as it's dug out by the catcher there. Now he's going to get a visit from his catcher just to make sure he's all right. But this might actually be more of a stall tactic here. I mean, his pitch count, it's starting to get up there, so... This might just be to buy a little time for that bullpen. Just off the inside part of the plate, it's three and one. Well, I think it's time to attack now because these guys haven't been in too many good hitters counts. This is where you need to pounce. And that's outside. He lost in ball four. Javier Lopez will come on here hoping to get the final two outs and put this one into the win column. First pitch coming. Starlin Castro is at the plate as he watches ball one. The 1-0 home. This is hit sharply to the left side. And heads up down there as he just had to cover up as this skips right over his head. Michael Kahn will come on here hoping to get the final two outs and pick up the save. Yeah, we see a lefty and a right-hander start to loosen up in the bullpen. First offering on the way. And this pitch is taken on the inner half for strike one. That's a two-seam fastball right there. It looks to the hitter like it's going to be inside, and then it tails back to the inside corner of the plate. And he gets some pretty good wood on it here as he's ah. lifted to fairly deep left. Holiday is going to get there as he backs up to put it away, and there are two gone now. Mark Melanson is on now to try to close things down here in the ninth. First pitch coming. Into center field. That's going to get down for a base hit. I don't know if I would have got that or not. And that'll hold the runner at third base. Rusne Castillo will stand in as the possible tying run, so expect him not to get cheated up there with the bases loaded. First pitch to him. And he makes oh, the man. There, but this is going to find the stands foul down the right field line. He waits. Now the pitch. And he might get them all home as this is hit high and deep out to straightaway left. And oh, you got to be side. kidding me. Oh, man. What the freak? Can't get a homer worth crap. Oh. Thought I might have lucked out. 
Oh, well, darn it. One more look at the final darn it, darn it, darn it. I got had more hits than them again. What the frick? The wow. I barely gave up any freaking hits at all. Holy well, you crap. Always hope to get a good outing from your starting pitcher, but this man Oh, I was so close to catching one. up. Oh, man. Ah, oh, man. Finish off the complete game, but he wound up well, darn it. Help to get the final two out. I'm getting the hits. It's just I can't get the freaking runs in. So that'll just about do it. For Eric Caro, Steve Lyons, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. This has been a presentation of the show. Straight Before, innings. Don't forget <laughs> to check out the shownation.com. Wow. The Red Sox win it 5-1. to one. So long from the Bronx.